all right guys so welcome to the parts of my walgreens haul that i am so excited about so you guys know yesterday um i was telling you guys that i got the booklet that the brainstorm coupons were in but i could not find that darn coupon anywhere i, I figure i just knew that they had changed the coupons on me and yada 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 so um i want to say thank you to all the people that commented on the video let me know what page it was on. It was an overlook on my part. It was in the book, but I just didn't go back far enough. Um, so I did find those, and I was able to get in on the Brain Strong deal. So thanks for all of you guys who, you know, let me know where it was at and everything like that. So um, my main purpose, like I said, was to go out and do the Brain Strong. Um, still shopping for my parents. So I wanted to utilize um, the most overs that I could so they could pay, you know, less out of pocket. So what they wanted to get was they wanted um, eight boxes of cereal, and you know the cereal is on sale four for ten, and you get three dollars in extra care, or sorry, three dollars in register rewards, making it four for seven. And I was able to print off some sixty cent coupons for the cinnamon toast crunch, and I still had the dollar off of two coupons. So I used those and brought my total down. Um, I think. Uh, I used two 60 cent ones in the first transaction and I used a dollar off of two one and um, okay yeah so the first transaction consisted of four of the cereals and I also got one of the clear sale the deal the deal with the clear sale is that it is on sale for three forty nine there is a two dollar off um, in store or it's in the um, it's in the insert so you have to show them that in order to get the two dollars off and then there's a one dollar printable not sure if it's still available um, I'll check and if it is I'll put the link to that um, below so I did one of those and I also did um, what else did I do I did the L'Oreal which you know is a money maker so that was really good for that so basically I just got the L'Oreal to um, offset the the cost for the cereal so I'll show you guys what my receipt looks like over here if it'll focus so that first thing you see I wanted to um, scan the gotta be because I heard it was a money maker but it wasn't on clearance in my store so I had them take that off then you have the cereal up there the um, clear sale for $349 then the L'Oreal for $379 all of my coupons the $3 off coupons for the L'Oreal and all of that as you can see the ten dollars off for the um, booklet so my subtotal was 44 cents and my sales tax was a dollar and twelve so basically it was all sales tax and I ended up paying 156 out of pocket and I got back a three dollar register reward so that was a major money maker major money maker so then I went to a different um Walgreens because the first one didn't have the brain strong so the second one so I went to they have the brain strong so I went ahead and took advantage of that and the deal that I did with that is I purchased um, two of the brain strongs and I purchased also um, four more cereals so I'll show you guys what that looked like and I also purchased some more L'Oreal just to get my um, total down a little bit now I'll show you guys the mistake that I made on this transaction and I will try to take it back. Um, can you take back clearance items? I'm not sure but I want to know. So if you guys know the answer to that please leave that below. Um, but as you can see here is the cereal deal. The Brain Strong is $12.99. The second one since it's buy one get one free is zero. Then you have the L'Oreal's and the cereals. All of my coupons are taken off. As you can see, my subtotal was five seventy-six, and the reason for that is because, as you can see, one of the L'Oreal's rung up for seven dollars and fifty-nine cents, and I was not expecting that. Um, so I'm gonna try to take that one back if we can take back clearance and get my money back for that because that was really unnecessary. So I just paid that out of pocket. Um, so my uh, total was six dollars and forty-eight cents, and I got back another three dollars in register rewards so um, that's not so bad three dollars and forty eight cents I guess if you look at it that way but I am still gonna try to take that um, seven dollar and fifty nine cent one so let me know if you can take back clearance items because I'm not really sure 
And then the last transaction that I did for the night was um, I went to another Walgreens. Excuse me. I went to another Walgreens and I picked up the All Detergent, the Brain Strong, and a Hawaiian Punch and some more of the L'Oreal's along with the Olay. Now I did the Olay. I think I showed you guys that deal yesterday. But if you didn't see my video yesterday, the deal on that is um, you buy two Olay's. They are they were ringing up for three twenty nine at my store, or let's see, they were ringing up for three forty nine at my store, and they're buy one get one fifty percent off. So that's the deal with that, and you use two dollar off coupons. And then since you bought two Olay products, which is the Ultra Lush Ultra Moisture, you can get two of the um, Luscious Embrace Olay body soaps. And those are also buy one get one free and we have those four dollar off coupons so that would actually create a 52 cent overage for you so that was a really good deal um, as long as they're like 4.99 and under I believe it'll create an overage for you which I think most of them are so that was the deal with that I wanted to get my mom some of those because um, I know she likes Olay so um, that was a pretty good deal and then the deal with the all detergent is um, if you see it saw 29 Luana's video with the brain strong it creates a three dollar and one cent overage so you have to pick something up to you know fill that overage so the all detergent is three ninety nine and there's a dollar off coupon making it two ninety nine so that fills the overage and then um, the Olay kind of helped fill the gaps and then I got some of the uh, some more of the L'Oreal just to fill in any other overage um, any other costs that there were so I'll show you guys the receipt if you guys focus okay so you have the all detergent at $3.99 then you have all of the Olay's and the brain strongs and I bought my hubby at Hawaiian Punch then you have two of the L'Oreal's and all of my coupons taken off as you can see my subtotal is 37 cents and my tax was one dollar and forty cents so my total was 177 pay that off pocket no biggie so it says my total savings was eighty dollars and fifty four cents very very good guys um i was really really excited about this haul i was able to get everything i want i'm gonna go back and do the brain strong deal a couple more times and so um hopefully i can get some more good things but um another thing i wanted to share with you guys is just you know, sometimes coupon couponing can be kind of frustrating when you're not able to get the deals. But as you can see, it's really worth it in the long run. I spent less than, I'd say, $15 out of pocket for all of this stuff. And if you would have walked into a supermarket or just, you know, on a regular basis, you would pay way more, at least a hundred and something dollars for this. Um, probably more like two. So, um, couponing is very worth it, and, you know, since I'm getting good, my parents have wanted me to start couponing for them, so, you know, I kind of feel kind of proud about that, because, you know, they see the stuff that I'm doing and the money that I'm saving, and so they want me to build their little stockpile, so, slowly but surely, we're getting stuff for their stockpile, so I'm kind of proud about that. Oh, and one more thing, um, kind of a rant, I was upset, I went over to Family or Dollar General, because as you know, there are there were all coupons on um, the website. They're all gone now. Sorry, but there was a dollar fifty off Dollar General coupon, and we had a dollar off coupons. So, oh, and the um, they were on sale at Dollar General for three dollars. So that we would only have to pay a dollar per detergent. Now, before I went to the store, I went on Southern Savers, I believe it was, and I looked at all of the comments and what people were saying, and most people said that, you know, people were rude, and they couldn't get the deal, they left it empty handed, and everything like that. So I kind of went in preparing for kind of like a fight or not to be able to get it. I didn't really go in with high hopes, I'll put it like that. So I go in, and I grab four of them, um... Because I hear that you, you can only do so many or something like that. So I just wanted to test it out. So I get, I did four of them. So I gave um, all my coupons to the cashier. And he scanned the dollar off uh, manufactured coupons first. Those all went through no problem. Then he got to the um, dollar general coupons. And it was a problem. So I guess the supervisor or manager or whoever she was. She came over and... Um, tried to enter it manually with the instructions of the coupon 
and um, she looked down and she said oh wait how many did you get I told her four she said um, you can only you can't use two coupons for one item I said but it's in your coupon policy that you know you can use two as long as one is a manufacturer coupon and one is a store coupon as long as one of the coupons don't say doesn't say that um, it can't be combined with any other coupon so she said oh no um, you can only use a, a store coupon when it's the five dollar off coupon so what what kind of sense does that make guys it's a store coupon but you can only use the five dollar in store coupon that made no sense so I said you know I, I was still trying to you know I was trying to be polite because I didn't want to argue but I was just like you know um, no I don't think that's right and she's like yeah it's right I know it's right so I'm like okay fine just take all of them off so she kind of got an attitude like what I'm like just take all of them off I don't want them so you know I was still polite at this point so she voided the order and re rung me up so I got the rest of the stuff that I had and I just didn't get the all so um what I should have done was I should have called corporate I might I probably will still call corporate just to get some clarity but I'm gonna try to go tomorrow and I'm gonna just tell um, if I still have any problems with the, you know, cashier, I'm just going to tell them, well, I talked to corporate and they said, you know, you can, yada, yada, yada. See how that goes. If that still doesn't work, then I'm definitely going to call corporate and have them try to call the store so I can get my deal. Because, you know, this is ridiculous. Managers think that they're just God and that they can make up the rules for their store because they, you know, just because of what they think it is. So, um, sorry, I don't mean to make this video really long, but yeah. So, um, <laughs> this is my haul, guys. I'm um, sorry for the little rant, but I hope you guys enjoyed everything, and I will put the information below so you can get these deals if you want to, and I will talk to you guys all later. Happy couponing, guys. Bye.